So when I finished work yesterday, um, it was sort of dry. I was about to take Russia out for a walk and the rain came. Anyway, it leathered it down all last night. Um, it did calm down about, I think it was about nine, 10 o'clock. Uh, but we had a lot of rain uh, late yesterday afternoon. <clears throat> and what's today gonna bring? So I've had uh, a checkout go, literally bang on nine o'clock. Uh, a couple more out and a few in this afternoon. And what's today gonna bring? I've going to go and do my washing. Yeah, first job. Let's go. Let's let's, let's go and put my washing in the washing machine. Get that uh, get that done. And this morning, what a beautiful day again. We've got a um, look at this. Just another another gorgeous day. And the job I don't have to do today is jump on the bins. <laughs> My apprentice did that when he was fixing the uh, fixing the gutters yesterday. Right, I've not heard from this um, mower place that uh, the service department should have got back to me yesterday. Um, so I'll give that until this afternoon, after one o'clock maybe, uh, and I've given them a full sort of 36 hours then, haven't I? Uh, see how we go. But the site's looking really nice this morning after all the rain and if the sun does burn off the moisture from the rain yesterday, I've got quite a lot of mowing to do today. Uh, there's the site today, look at that. I'm going to fill up the, uh, fill up the dog water bowls. Um, and then anybody's been down the lane for some walkies. I've got fresh water. I feel sort of quite eerie coming back in here with uh, no Wendy and Paul. Um, they've not been here that long, so, well, several weeks. My sort of fixtures and fittings feels like they've been here forever sort of thing. And sort of coming back here all on my own again. It's a bit like how I started off the season where it was just uh, just me and a campsite. <laughs> anyway, let's, uh, let's get the fresh water ready. Right, it's gone give my uh, morning walk around. That's everybody off. That should be off. Um, and I'm gonna have a look how wet the grass is, whether or not I'm gonna get any mowing done today or not. Hello, Robin. So. The um, hard standing pitches, the fully serviced pitches, they're all, um, they're all gonna be full again this afternoon and coming into the weekend. Um, all the island pitches, they're all, uh, they're all going to be taken as well. Uh, very busy weekend coming up. That's our, that should be our last final full weekend. And then things start to dip down. So just checking the... And so the grass is coming back. When I look at those camping pitches, we've got loads of mushrooms as well. Um, So we had somebody here the other day um, who was into all of that foraging and they, apparently a lot of them are edible. Don't eat a mushroom or a toastal unless you know what you're doing though. Uh, look, look, look at them all, I've got loads of them, all different, all different sizes and different types. Grass is way too wet to uh, start cussing at the moment. This need this needs to burn off. Uh, I'll go over where uh, Dan and Mazzy are currently staying. They've got some um, absolutely ginormous uh, toll sills. Uh, we're gonna have a look at those shortly. But I just wanna go and check these tent pitches. If you remember a while back, um, well, a while back, a couple of videos back, we're going to be putting some seed down in a couple of weeks, so let's go and see how these are doing. All this rain is going to be really good. Oh, these are firming up now. Oh, look at these. Look, look at the... Yeah. All oh, the grass is coming through. Uh, yeah, even this one, the grass, you can see the grass coming, coming back. Okay. 
I was going for an inspection of the bird table, Dan. Um, my, yeah. my bird table. Your yeah. bird table, your bird table set well, yeah. Well, you capture, you, you, like, you, I saw, uh, was it last night video, you had a, an app with all these all these birds about and everything. Yeah, yeah. What have you been capturing? Oh, all sorts. Um, eagles, kites, meadow, um, pulpits, I think they're called. Uh, loads of rare ones, a stalk. All Dan has been capturing, Pelican. after him slagging me off, all he's been capturing, all this bird table of his has been feeding is um, is robins. No, what I'm going to go and do... That's not I, true, I'm gonna it's go one and, robin. Well, it's not, what's his name? I don't know, but he's really scruffy. Rob, robin, Robin, right. <laughs> I'm going to go and put some stuff on my bird table and I'm going to show you an array of birds that will come onto my table. So keep away from my bird table. I saw what you did without that note. I'll try to pinch my birds. Look, it's, it's dog eat dog in this world. Dog eat dog. Hey, hang on a minute, Robins. Can you eat them? Is that a meat option? Don't say that. Stop, 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 stop. No. Right, so these are the back of uh, uh, the Travel Trolls vans. Look at these. Uh, yeah, loads of them, and this pitch here, these have been on for, um, I think, uh, just over a week. So this grass is really long. I need to get this cut, but the grass is uh, way too wet at the moment. Oh, fairy tales. Loads of them. Oh, hang on a minute. Let's... Absolutely, tons of them. Look, look here on this pitch here, don't know that's picking up and up. And so I'm not too sure which is uh, what's edible and what's not edible. Right. See what uh, we'll see what the grass is like in another hour. Hang on, there's a stone. I always find these stones. Right, so I'm uh, doing some signs and bits and bobs uh, for laminating. So. Um, we're open until the end of October, uh, as mentioned earlier, this weekend coming up, we are, I think pitch number five is still free, but we're, we're really, really busy, uh, and then things quiet down, uh, but we're open until the end of October, and we've got some seasonal pitches have, uh, definitely now become available, so, Um, not just um, on our side, but if you are thinking about getting a seasonal pitch and it's a good site, make sure you get on their waiting list. Don't leave it too late. Uh, and now this time of year, as uh, contracts are being, uh, new contracts are being issued and people are deciding, or oh, we don't want to uh, renew our contracts or whatever, now's the perfect time to get on a seasonal waiting list. Um, so, yeah, take that as a top tip. Don't leave it too late. Eliminating these. Laminators, they always have bubbles in, don't they? In the hairs, if you're flipping, if you've got hair, it's going to go in the uh, in the laminator. Anyway, right, so I'm just going to laminate a couple of signs and put on our exterior um, notice board and I'm going to put a couple on our interior notice board. I mean, Charlie, that's a bit rubbish, isn't it? Look, the, the, the laminator was hungry. It, it ate it. Very hungry. I need to re, uh, redo another one. I'm just not sure what's going on here. Right, so the laminator is broken. It's just eaten two sheets and not spat them out and I can't get at it. So I'm going to let it cool down uh, and open it up with a screwdriver. What could possibly go wrong? Right. Uh, it's... Uh, it's gone really warm, so it's, I've got me, me jacket on, but it's definitely gone a bit warm. Right, back in the office for a bit. All right, I'm going to make myself a cup of coffee, take it back to the office, and I'm going to uh, replenish my bird table. Yo, 
yesterday Dan claimed that the only bird I capture was a robins. He's got no idea. Amateur, amateur twitch. So loaded up, ready to go. We'll um, see what we can capture, shall we? Uh, yeah, I'm not going, not going to do the wildlife cam. We'll do a, we'll do another method of recording my bird action. So the only thing that's not popular and my fat balls these get a little bit pecked but not really pecked and dan doesn't know that the secret to um happy birds that come back to your table is giving them a little roof now what also dan possibly doesn't know is my roof comes off look and the reason i leave it all stained like this is it's camouflaged and that's the top secret, Dan, you see, because the birdies think it's it's like wild, not not bits of um, metal hanging about. This is this is El Natural. Right, let's see what um see what this camera catches. How are you doing? Hmm? What are you doing? Hmm? All right, so I did, uh, in the end, uh, doing a quick chase up with the um, these people who fix mowers and farm machinery, etc. And I got a very prompt email back saying somebody would be in touch. And uh, yeah, fair, fair. Fair dues to them. Uh, ten minutes later, I've just taken a phone call, so they've got all the information they need. I now need to set up an account with them, um, so they're going to um, forward an email on to me. And all being well, early next week we can get the uh, the Steiger mower, the the little yellow peril, into um, into action again. Best mower going that. Love that mower. Right, it's just becoming a. This has been a a sit in the office uh, day so far. Um, yeah. Okay. Right. Paperwork. That's all in hand. I'm gonna now go and jump onto the um, uh, sit on mower, the big orange mower, and um, give a couple of pitches a clean, a, a clean, a, a mow. Um, but I'm not too sure whether this is gonna be successful or not because the ground is still rather damp and we don't want a clogged up mower, do we? I've got a feeling that Dan and Mazzy may have an illness, a fear of ducks. I think they're going to get haunted by a duck. So Quack. my cafe is not in use. I've taken advantage and um, <coughs> doing my weekly pot wash on the um, with a dishwasher. So I normally um, do it all uh, in in the awning. But uh, anyway, just lobbed everything into there. Even getting the dog's food bowl a wash today. Uh, right, I'm now waiting for today's arrivals. Um, Whew, where are we? Two o'clock and that's strange. Nobody in yet, but uh, we'll wait and see what time uh, we're going to get everybody on pitch today. You know, I have some very, very weird things going on. Um, you will know that I've set up a, a sort of uh, campsite warden Facebook group, a new one and Facebook page because I've been banned from um, another one for for being basically for being a warden, an active warden. Um, and one of the moderators um, joined my new group uh, a few days ago. And the two people who've actually banned me, uh, and I know who they are, so it's not rocket science. Um, I'll just do that very quickly. Um, they want uh, approval to join my group. So so I just find that a bit weird sort of thing. They, they, they've banned me for talking and they've banned me for setting up a group, but they want to come and join my group and things like that. It's just... Uh, yeah, just tell me, is that, does, it, does, does that seem a bit weird to you? 
I think it's a bit weird. Right, so that's uh, a good portion of the seasonal area all um, all done, and oops, I've got a new sticker. Can you see that? Yeah, I might spot a campsite warden sticker on there soon. This is becoming um, yeah the sticker tractor. So if you come and stay at the nurseries, you get these stickers. Maybe you could put them on the um, on the tractor. Right, I need to go and empty my um, uh, grass box on here. Uh, I'm waiting for uh, another check-in to come in. So, the site's looking really pretty. Let's go past these grass areas, which I've just done. So we have got um, tents on here this weekend, and people in the pod. Seasonal pitch. That one's free. This one's going to come free. And we're going to have a few other ones um, will become free soon. But have a look at some of the uh, have a look at some of the uh, area we're in. Just giving Russia her after work walk. Doing rush. Uh, lots of sniffs down on the dog walk and then I just need to go and have a quick word with Dana Mazze about an arrangement. <laughs> Rasha was a bit freaked out by the um, by the tractor there. She doesn't normally do it. Well, that's the first time she's ever sort of gone, whoa, what's going on? Um, yeah, that's quite funny that. Right, so that's another day done. Um, yeah, not too bad, quite busy as ever, but a lot of mowing. Uh, tomorrow's quite a slackish day, and so you'll probably know I've not been getting any days off the last couple of weeks. So I'm hoping I'm gonna be able to do a shop and get out for a little bit tomorrow. Uh, I've got a, an idea somewhere that I'd like to try and visit. So um, yeah, we'll get on with that. Uh, right, that's it. That uh, video is just about shut there for now. As ever, if you watch it till the end, thanks ever so much. Don't forget to smack the like button. Amazing. Subscription button down there if you wanted to. Take it easy, guys. I'll see you on the next one.